Wife returned from work trip in Vegas with amnesia and bruises. AITA for pressing the issue? My, 42M, wife, 43F, of 15 years, went to a trade show in Vegas with her two boss. Both bosses are men. From the time she arrived in Vegas, they began drinking, doing shots and drinking beer. They attended the trade show and drank at a happy hour there, and then went to a dinner where they drank more, and then to Fremont Street to finish out the night with more drinking. The next day, they attended the trade show, went to lunch and did shots, went to a dinner that evening and did more shots and had mixed drinks. My wife, at this point, reports having lost all memories with the exception of sitting in a room that looked like heaven. During this period of blackout, she FaceTimed me sobbing and saying she was triggered by seeing someone we knew from years ago when she went through a health scare. It didn't make sense to me that she was so emotional about this person. I encouraged her to go back to the hotel, or drink water and eat something. She said that she would. About three hours later she called me saying I don't know where I am. I don't know how long I've been here. I don't know where anyone else is. She was not crying, but was disoriented. I again encouraged her to reach out to her bosses and try to get a lift back to the hotel. She called me an hour later, 11.49 PM, to say that her boss was coming to pick her up, but she did not know where she was. That was the last call from her. I did not hear from her the rest of the night. She declined my calls, eight of them, until almost 2 AM. She called me after 11 AM the next day, with no recollection of what happened. I picked her up from the airport, and she was in a stupor for the most part. She came home and went straight to sleep on the couch. She was disoriented and tired for the next 24 hours or so, and went back to work. Later that day, I noticed bruises on her arms, and asked to see her back. There were bruises on her back, biceps, knees, butt, ankles, ribs, and elbows. She has no recollection of falling or anything like that. I express my concern to her that she may have been sexually assaulted, and although scared, responds that she does not think that she was. I do not want to press it, it is her choice, but I wish that I would have. We looked through her phone, and there were pings at odd locations from her boss to her. There were selfies she took that she doesn't remember. I am not sure if I am overreacting, and I am terrified if even the slightest possibility exists that she was sexually assaulted. At the very least, her bosses put her in a position to be drunker than I have ever been in my life, which I think is unacceptable. She has been back to work since then, and is doing another trade event, locally, with them less than a week after. AITA for pressing the issue, and expressing that I am concerned for her to be around them? Ada for being suspicious? Edit, I am asking because she has been avoidant about discussing it, and even minimizing my concerns. Edit, remove potentially identifying info, 